Hey guys, it's Black History Month here in America, and we're here at a college campus to ask people their opinion about race and religion in America. Who said this to a freed black slave? I heard your footsteps ahead of me in heaven. Harriet Tubman. Harriet Tubman? Harriet Tubman, I don't know. None of the above. Frederick Douglass. This is something probably that like a super educated person did. Yeah, like, All right, none yeah. of the above. None of the above? Yeah. Harriet Tubman. I agree, none of the above. Sorry. <laughs> None of the above, it was the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. You're absolutely right. So it was the Prophet Muhammad, the founder of Islam. Founder of Islam. Uh, that's actually crazy. None of the above. Who? It was actually the founder of Islam, Muhammad. Really? 1400 years ago. That's tough. You know, in his last sermon, uh, the founder of Islam, he actually said that no white person is superior to a black person. No black person is superior to a white person. I feel we're all equal. You know, our God above made us all equal in his eyes. You know, nobody is superior to him. And if you think so, then you're wrong. To him, to us, he is superior. He is the almighty and he has the last judgment and saying. The one thing I like about Islam is that you guys don't have a picture of God. But if you go to like the Catholic Church or other churches, they always have this white God. You always start to believe like God is white. And I don't believe that's right. I belong to a community, uh, the Ahmadiyya Muslim community. The worldwide head of our community said that the way for America to achieve harmony and peace in society is if you resolve your racial issues, if you find racial harmony and peace within uh, this society. That is the pathway to peace. If you're, if you're asking the question, if the beliefs of Islam are something, are the answer based on what little I know what my friend has informed me and what I've what I've looked up on my own it, yeah Islam's teachings are like amazing when it comes to race relations when it comes to gender relations when it comes to like, just relations of people in general and making sure that we're all focusing on ourselves and our relationships with God I know for me it's been the answer and those teachings can be helpful to everybody in the world whether or not they fully agree with everything